Meteora Monastery is the miracle of Greece, few kilometers northwest of the town of Kalabaka. The impressive rocks of Meteora are rising from the plains of Thessaly, being one of the most amazing places in Greece. Many centuries ago, on these gigantic rocks with the breathtaking landscape reaching height of more than 600 meters, it was formed one of the most important monastic communities of Greece. The Greek word meteora means suspended in the air, and this phrase amply describes these remarkable Greek Orthodox monasteries. The origin of the extraordinary zoological formations are difficult to explain. Instead of being volantic rock which tend to form similar structures, they are largely formed of sandstone and various deposits of stone, sand, and mud that have arisen from the deposits brought by streams following into a delta at the edge of a large lake. About 60 million years ago, a series of earth movements from the seabed created a vertical plateau featuring many distinct fault lines in its layer of stone. The complex is made up of 24 Eastern Orthodox monasteries that were built on giant sandstone rock pillars between the 14th and 16th centuries. Six of them are still in use today and can be visited by the public, while others are popular for sightseeing extremely by hikers and photographers. They also represent an important part of Greek history and the link between early formation of Christian doctrine and the Turkish occupation of Greece during the 11th century AD. Meteora was added to the UNESCO World Heritage List in 1988 because of the outstanding architecture and beauty of the complex is adding to its religious and artistic significance. Meteora monasteries are an important spiritual destination for Orthodox Christians. So you must be dressed appropriately in order to enter the monasteries. Sleeveless shirts are forbidden for both men and women. Men are required to wear long pants and women must wear long skirts. Originally there were a total of 24 monasteries in Meteora, but today there are only 6 standing. They are closed on different days on the week and have different visiting hours. With 3 days, you will be able to visit all of them. You have to pay 3 euro fee to entry each monastery.